Dear Heavenly Father, today we come before you in awe of the breathtaking beauty of your creation. As we stand in a lush forest where the trees stretch high into the sky, we are reminded of Psalm 96, 12. Let the fields be jubilant and everything in them. Let all the trees of the forest sing for joy. We marvel at the vibrant colors of a setting sun, painting the sky with hues of orange, pink and gold just as you painted the heavens in Genesis 1.16. As we reflect on the beauty around us, we say a heartfelt prayer for peace, inspired by John 14.27. Peace I leave with you, my peace I give you. May these images of majestic mountains, serene lakes and vibrant meadows remind us of the tranquility that exists in your creation, as stated in Psalm 23. Two, he makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside quiet waters. Let the songs of birds and the rustling of leaves soothe our souls, guiding us to a place of inner calm, as in Psalm 104.12. The birds of the sky nest by the waters. They sing among the branches. We envision the gentle waves of a pristine beach, the sun shimmering on the water like diamonds, reflecting your glory as in Psalm 93.4. Mightier than the thunder of the great waters, mightier than the breakers of the sea, the Lord on high is mighty. We picture the serene stillness of a snow-covered landscape, where each flake falls like a blessing from above, as in Isaiah 1.18, Though your sins are like scarlet, they shall be as white as snow. We think of the exotic creatures that roam our planet, from the regal lion to the delicate butterfly, each one a testament to the wonders of your creation, as in Job 12, 7, 10. But ask the animals, and they will teach you, or the birds in the sky, and they will tell you. In every corner of the globe, from the depths of the rainforest to the heights of the mountains, there is beauty that speaks to our hearts, as in Psalm 19, 1. The heavens declare the glory of God, the skies proclaim the work of his hands. Let us cherish and protect these natural wonders, and in doing so may we find a path to peace, as in Genesis 2.15, the Lord God took the man and put him in the Garden of Eden to work it and take care of it. Let our hearts be as open and expansive as the clear blue sky, and may our spirits soar free like the eagles that glide effortlessly above, as in Isaiah 40.31. But those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles. As we close our eyes and breathe in the essence of nature, let's offer a prayer for all beings, inspired by Philippians 4, 6, 7. Do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition with thanksgiving, present your requests to God. May every person, every creature, and every corner of this world find peace and harmony as in Romans 12, 18. If it is possible, as far as it depends on you, live at peace with everyone. May we all live in a world where beauty is cherished and the bonds of love and respect hold us together, as in Colossians 3, 14. And over all these virtues put on love, which binds them all together in perfect unity. Thank you, Lord, for this journey through your magnificent creation. May the images we've seen and the words we've heard stay with us, inspiring us to find peace within ourselves and spread it to those around us. As in Matthew 5, 9, blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called children of God. Until next time, may we keep our hearts open to the wonders of your creation. Amen. End of script.